What's good, Humble Squad? It's your boy, Humble Ziggy. We back here with another reaction for y'all. And today, we got Mr. 954 Mari himself with JHB Boss Demon Slayer a moves on AMV. Now, hey, you already know. Depending on how we gonna get on this, cause you already know when it comes to Mari and these Demon Slayer songs, shit, still to this day, one of his favorite like fire ones and such is Upper Moon. Cause boy, do I still be bumping to that shit. But don't get me wrong, he does have other good ones too. But it's just something about how that menacing sound and such when it's even though it's still fuck a Kaza for killing Rengoku, I ain't gonna lie, he be badass. As much as we want it, as much as we all are saying fuck him, he's still badass nonetheless. So hey, I don't, I don't mind Mari putting out a song like that for him and such. Even if it's for somebody else, but still. But has he actually only just, but Mari, you should only just make it a full Akaza song. Full Akaza. What did you already do? I don't know. The, but you should. But either way, just from me, pre just from like previews of listening to it and such, setting this up, sounds like about to get pretty like saucy or so. So let's go into it. So we better check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get into the video. Black diamonds, of course. I you wanna hate your pipe down. I've been awesome, even time. I just wanna slay some right now. I got mama, fantasize. Got you water, bring the heavy girl, you might try. I was right, saucy vibes. Even time. I just wanna slay some right now. Posted like he owe me how the neck and wrist rocked up. He knew coming, cargo, a little shoddy girl, you hot stuff. I was six, she in hysteria when we chop it up. Time it ain't no hysteria finna stop us Girl, we got some history, you love it when I talk tough You could be my mentity, don't tell me that it's not love Stir you up like Commodore, Campfire, Potluck Level on, hush run, baby girl, I bossed up One short and ting and he got three baddies kicking I got two baddies with me like Suma, Hina Pulling her heartstrings when we switch positions Play her fingers like Nakime, Biwa, Biwa Moves on, Mike Jack, too smooth, white cap Moves on, Mike Jack, too smooth Yo, Mario on his saucy vibe Yeah, I figured now we gonna run that back and such cause he on his saucy vibes. Hold up. Hold up, Mari. We had to run it back for the one time cause man's on his saucy vibe. Sometimes we like saucy Mari on the beat. Crawling. I ain't crawling. See you sliding. Oh, you wanna hide down. I've been awesome. Time and time. I just wanna slice some right now. What you say, Mari? Posted like he on me, had a neck and was rocked up. He knew coming, Kagura, little shoddy girl, you hot stuff. I was six, she in hysteria when we chop it up. Demon time, ain't no hysteria, finna stop us. Girl, we got some history, you love it when I talk tough. You could be my mentity, don't tell me that it's not love. Stir you up, Hashiro. Like Commodore, Campfire, Potluck, Level on, Hashiro. Baby girl, I bossed up. One short and ting, and he got three baddies kicking. I got two baddies with me, like Suma, Hina. When we switch positions, play her fingers like Nakime, Biwa, Biwa Moves on Mike Jack, too smooth white cap Drop it, it's saucy, won't never get your life back King of the- This saucy will never get your life back? Mm. Yo, angle cap though Moves on Mike Jack? That's a fire ass name Even though he a demon But still, that's a fire ass That's a fire ass name for a nigga <laughs> Moves on my jack. Moves on my jack. Too smooth white cap. Drop it in sauce. Get your life back. Get your life back. King of the night. I be cooling in the day. Tell a douche what I say. She said, baby boy, I like that. Man, they crawling. crawling. See me sliding. Why you wanna hate this right now? And then this nigga, JHB boss. Y'all be sleeping on JHB. And crazy thing is, right? Crazy thing about JHB. Even though this nigga is always known for his singing. Y'all be sleeping on him when it comes to the rapping, but don't get it twisted. This man can give you a, he's one of those rappers who can literally give you a mean ass hook and a mean ass verse. Right now, I'm right now. Shining up, slay every time she on the run. Upper rank six, 
body but she never won All these eyes on the know she did me from the jump Sonny slide on me, I'm a slayer one on one Ain't no coming, walking, baby, know you fire Got my back like this, I'm cool, I know that she a rider But I'm like, cool, I know she a rider Cause literally <laughs> I had to carry Nezuko on her back every single time. I guarantee you, she was probably a hit. Let me not say that, but she was probably heavy as hell. I mean, she is a deep. She was a demon after all, so she is probably still heavy, but still. in six like what was I saying 2006 freaking T-Pain vibes nigga fuck you me with the uh, cuz that's the right type of auto tune in where cuz let's be honest today's type of era where people are using the auto tune for like crooning and such ain't gonna lie mm -mm, it ain't and most rappers should not be using it Cause let's be honest, y'all be thinking y'all singing and whatnot, or y'all think y'all be vibing out to the auto tune and whatnot. Mm -mm. Y'all ain't hitting it right. But a hey, certain rappers or certain singers, or so you can say, especially in the nerdcore community, boy, they will give you. For me personally, I can't speak for everybody, but for me personally, and for people who are like me and such, I can, I guess I can say, nigga, when they start to hit the right notes, and especially with the auto-tune, trust me, that's the good vibe right there. That's that 2000s vibe and such. Like I said, that T-Pain vibes where nigga, and plus me, if you know about T-Pain in them 2000s, boy, that man was Everywhere with his shit. This part right here. this Mari and I know you've seen and I know you're probably gonna see this well you're definitely gonna see this you have not been cursing in your songs as of late and I'm it's such a weird thing cuz first Fable is doing it now Mari I ain't gonna trip hey do you how I to me I've always say that sometimes when you're when it comes to certain music I get it that most people don't want to hear curse words, but here's the thing, to me, now, hey, you choose how you want to do it, but to me, I always feel like if you just don't, not to say you're going to curse all in your songs, but when you put in a certain curse word at a certain line and such, it really gives you more, oof, really more emotional on it and such. That's how I look at it. But lately, hey, especially with Mari, Kind of crazy to hear him not cursing on a song. Hell, even when he's act, even when he's talking tough on a song. Kind of weird to hear him not cursing in a while and such. Because I did remember him tweeting about how three of his certain songs and such, like Aura, Big Appa, nah, Big Rock of the Appa, and what was it? It was another third song that didn't have a curse, that wasn't cursing in there and such. I don't know, but them two ones that I just recently heard, and now this one, yo, somehow, I don't know why, but for me, don't get it twisted, it's still a fire song, but I'm just wondering, Mari, if you've seen this, just let me know, why you not cursing in your songs, are you not cursing in your songs no more, or are you just choosing the time when you want to curse in your songs, or you don't want to, the times when you do want to curse in your songs, or you don't want to curse in your songs, because either way, I still rock with it, no matter what. Just want to know, but 
back to the sauciness. It's gonna, you already know what Amari's song is gonna be on my playlist for shit sure. Cause what? Cause I already, I've been listening to Aura on repeat. Now I got another one. Goddamn. Is there a, I guarantee you there's gonna be a time where Amari don't, where Amari miss. But until then, I doubt. To be honest, I doubt it. Not even, not just even Amari, any of these Nerco artists. I doubt that they're ever gonna miss. But look. Y'all let me know what y'all thought about this down in the comments below. Let me know if this is the most sauciest song you've ever heard from Mari. Or, yes, probably more. But let me know in the comments below. But either way, it's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. And hey, if you made it to the end of this reaction, comment down below. Moves on, Mike Jack. And that makes me know you made it to the end. But it's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. I'm out.